Suppose you are building a fantastic machine that needs one crucial ingredient to run, but it's very hard to make this ingredient. And once you have made it, it's extremely fragile. How do you ensure a constant, reliable, regular supply? This is the problem that we solve to build a quantum network, a network of quantum information that can be used to build super-fast quantum computers, to make very accurate measurements, or to create unbreakable quantum cryptographic codes. The essential ingredient is quantum entanglement, a curious link between different quantum particles that allows you to do, essentially, an unlimited number of calculations in parallel. But it is also extremely fragile. As soon as you have created it, interactions with the outside world will start to degrade it. Researchers at QTech at Delft University designed a method to generate quantum entanglement faster than it decays. Furthermore, we showed that our system was so robust that it could be trusted to produce entanglement reliably at set intervals. We use tiny diamond crystals with an electron sitting in it. This can point up or down, or it can be like Schrodinger's famous cat in a superposition of up and down at the same time. We reset two of our diamonds into this superposition and then shine a laser pulse on them. This can make them emit a photon, a light particle, which is quantum entangled with the electron. When you combine two of these photons using a semi-transparent mirror and try to detect the photon that comes out, this act of measuring may carry over the entanglement to both electrons. If that happens, you will detect a photon, telling you that the entanglement was a success. However, there is a much larger chance that the photons get lost on the way somehow. Since this recipe obviously cannot be counted upon, we created an assembly line to make things more reliable. First, we try to create entanglement up to thousands of times until we finally get the photon saying success. As soon as that happens, we start caring for our entangled state, shielding it from harmful outside influences with gentle microwave pulses until delivery time, every tenth of a second. Our best setup, after some fiddling, generates 39 entangled pairs per second, which will only decay five times per second. The resulting assembly line produces an entangled state at a clockwork timing of 10 times a second, with a guaranteed quality over 50% to produce a reliable supply which could fuel a quantum network. And yes, we're also working on that. <laughs>